Welcome to the African Leadership Series, where we bring you great inspirational speeches from African leaders. Who in this room does not wish to see our debt simply cancelled? If you don't, you can take the first flight to the World Bank to go and pay to the World Bank. I would like this conference to clearly declare that we cannot pay the debt, not in a rebellious spirit, but just to avoid being assassinated individually. In Burkina Faso, I'm the only one to refuse, and I might not be in the next conference. But on the other hand, with everybody's support, And when we are saying that we should not pay the debt, we are not refusing our responsibilities or not keeping our words. It's just that we don't have the same moral standards as others. Between the rich and the poor, moral standards cannot be the same. The Bible or the Quran cannot serve those who exploit people and those exploited ones in the same way. We should have two editions of the Bible and two editions of the Quran. Brothers, with everybody's support, we will make peace at home. We will be able to use Africa's full potential, as well as develop our country because our land is rich. We have enough manpower and we have a very large market. From the north to the south to the east to the west, we have enough brain power to create or at least go and learn science and technology where it can be learned from. Mr. President, let's present a united front against the debt here in Addis Ababa. Let's make sure that this conference will decide to limit the arms race between poor and weak countries, the clubs and knives that we buy are useless. Let's make sure that the African market belongs to Africans. Let's produce in Africa, manufacture in Africa and consume in Africa. Let's produce what we need and consume what we produce. Instead of importing goods, Burkina Faso came here to show our locally produced cotton, woven in Burkina Faso, tailored in Burkina Faso, to clothe our own people. I, along with my delegation, am dressed by our tailors, our farmers. Not a single thread comes from Europe or America. I'm not presenting a fashion show here, but simply, I would like to say, that we must accept to live the African way. It's the only way to live in freedom and with dignity. Thank you, Mr. President. Our homeland or death of, we will win. If you like informative and educational videos on Africa, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to catch all our latest videos.